Hello everyone. Happy Halloween. Uh, that sounds so weird for me to say. Um, fun fact about me, I have never celebrated Halloween a day in my life. So this is all new to me. Like I didn't grow up celebrating Halloween. I didn't grow up doing trick-or-treating, anything like that. So this just came to me like very spur of the moment. I'm filming this on the 31st and it's getting uploaded sometime today on the 31st. So this should be up before midnight. Fingers crossed. But anywho, um, as you can see, I've already started. Um, my sister asked me, she said, are you going for an Egyptian look? And I said, um, it's basically what we have going on here. What I've done so far is I've done a cut crease. But I did, I went a little bit above my crease area because I have like a very small crease. So I did go a little bit above and I'm looking down so you all can get a good picture of it I've already added the glitter here so it's like a glitter cut crease and what I did to to get the wings like the double wing or double line I don't, I don't, I don't know what it's called but um I just aligned my lash line with the same black radiance cream liner from yesterday and I used the same brush a little tight right above my crease with it so that's what we got um this is my first time ever doing a crease so uh, a crease eye look this is the reason why I didn't film that part I think I think I kind of got the hang of it a little bit so what I'm what I plan on doing is glitter look for fall before this before the fall ends and the winter comes in so yeah um I'm really not doing this the correct way I know because I know you need like the um the adhesive or you need the um the glitter the glue for the glitter to make it really stick but for purposes of today this being spurred the moment and also I want to be able to get this off pretty easily because this is really out of my league right now I have what I did for this I used this paintbrush this is from I think Walmart and it came in like a pack I'll show it at the end but it came in a pack of different color brushes and they're all with this um, different colors like it's a blue yellow orange I thought they were cute but it's very pointed as you can see it's a little bit of glitter on it. What I've been doing is I've just been dipping ink, dipping. I had a bottle of water. Had a bottle of water. I took the cap off. I poured a little water just to have a cap full of water in it. And then I have been dipping it in the water. And I'll show a picture of this. But this is the glitter I'm using. This glitter is called rocking the night sparkly glitter but it's from fashion nova it came in a pack of three different colors and i got it like some months ago and i just decided i would use that and i'm just using a makeup wipe and i have my glitter on it i don't want any to fall out and that's what i'm using i started out with a little bit and i'm already pretty much done with this one so yeah we're just gonna start working on the left eye and then after that what i'm gonna do is do my foundation off camera then i'm gonna come back and do all the fun stuff with you all and apply all the different items and props and stuff I got to complete this look. And no, I don't know what the look is yet, but we're, we're going to do this together. So you all will know when I know. So I'm pretty much done with this one. Um, I'm going to start on this one. So I'm just dipping a brush right now in water. Then I'm swirling the end of the brush in a glitter. And that's how much glitter is on it. Then I'm just going to start swiping it across. And it is going to be a little fallout. But because, I guess, because the brush is wet, I just kind of blow up on my eye. That way, um, it won't be too much, too much glitter fallout. I just don't want to have glitter everywhere tomorrow. You know they say when well, you don't like somebody to send them um, send them an envelope full of glitter. <laughs> and they will never be able to get rid of it. <laughs> and that is so true because glitter is one of those things that it's just kind of. I love the look of it but I hate working with it. I'm about to apply 
some mascara because this is like my this be my best friend this big shot mascara because it makes my tiny lashes look like I have a little bit of lashes I'm getting some lash glue today y'all so the next makeup looks I will have lashes on and I know this look would have been so pretty with lashes but hey gotta work with what you got Okay, and that's pretty much the finished look. My eyes, I'll be adding highlighter in my um, brow bone and stuff at the end. But, yeah, now I'm going to stop right here and I'm going to do my foundation and I'll come back once I finish. So, stay tuned. Okay, now I am back. As you can see, I've added another necklace on and my makeup and everything is finished. So, now we're going to get to... Hopefully the fun part. I don't know really what I'm doing. I have like these gold sequins that I want to do like on my lip. Then I have this um, chunky glitter right here that's, that I want to use for something. I have gold glitter glue. This is clearly a golden bronze goddess look. Um, have this little gold marker thing here. So... So I have this open and they're like ranging from different sizes in here like big and little so I want to do sequins on my lip but just on the bottom half so we're going to do that part first and we're going to use this glitter glue here squeeze out I think it's like a stopper or something in here yeah it's just like this and you put a little stopper out first off before I add this stuff to my lip let me put on my baby lips here just making sure my lips are moisturized because I have a feeling this I hope this works <laughs> I don't know I'm going to put this glue on my lip on my bottom half of my lip I'm going to apply just like a lipstick. Okay. That's about much how much I have on. And I'm going to use... This is the brush pack I was telling you all about. This is from Walmart. It's just triangle brushes. It's a six pack. But anywho, I got these from Dollar Tree. So I'm going to use one of these. And I probably should have had this open before I put this on my lip. But anywho, um, we're gonna use this little paintbrush here to spread it. And I'm just gonna start applying it on there. So I'm gonna do a big one. This is not easy to do with nails, FYI. <laughs> um, yeah, no. Not a fan of this. It's the glitter glue. I need to use something else. Glue, some transparent glue. It's from um, Dollar Tree as well. Let me try this because that's not sticking. Yeah, that's more secure. <sighs> okay. Done. Done, done, done. Can't take no more. On the top lip, we're going to do glitter. And I'm just going to find some lip gloss. So the glitter can stick to it. Hopefully this turns out better. I'm just pouring uh, this glitter into this top it came in. 
I'll dip it in water so the glitter will stick to it. Okay, done with that. Dumping this back in here very carefully. Okay, I am back. Um, a little hard for me to talk with this sequin stuff on my um, mouth. So, yeah. <laughs> Bear with me. To tie this in a little more, I'm going to add sequin somewhere else on my face. I know, I know, I know. I'm just going to end the video here. I will come back at the end with pictures of my hair and I'm going to add a little chain across the top of my head if it all works out. But thank you all for watching. Um, let me know how I did. My strap keeps falling. Let me know how I did. Remember to like, comment, and subscribe. See you in my next video.